we're ready to go on a busy weekend of IndyCar racing on this seven-eighths of a mile bull ring of an oval and a first-time pole sitter under the lights. Connor Daly says, I'm gone, let's go. And the doubleheader is underway here in Myra. Really early start for Connor Daly. He wanted to jump on Newgarden because the outside line can sometimes be the fast line, but Newgarden coming back quickly as he's now going to look to the inside, and he's there. Putting the pressure on Connor Daly very early. Daly responds, though, up on that higher line and isn't intimidated at the moment from Joseph Newgarden. Well, as he tries to make another move in the opening laps, Tim Sindrick telling Joseph okay, Newgarden outside. just to be patient. You see him making the move around the outside. They said, look it, Connor Daly will come back to you. Just be patient. So it seems like he was kind of biding his time, as you said. Doesn't take long around here to start hitting lap traffic. Simon Pagano wheeling the Menard Chevrolet for Team Penske started last. He's currently first, but is due to pit very soon. He's done in excess of 80 laps. He's, what's he up to now? 84 Broken. laps he is on here. Caution, it's full power. Oh no, his uh -oh. tire's missing. It, it looks like the tire came off. A front tire missing off the car, so I wonder if they didn't get that wheel on. There it goes, something, he says something, something broke. broke. So this is really gonna shake things up and this really plays out for Simon Pagano right now because he has yet to pit. You see the replay here. Yes, he just didn't get it tight. He's got one hand on the, I don't think he's pressing the wheel, the yeah. wheel nut, the, the lever on the gun. And I've never seen that move before, Paul, trying to do the, the, the wing one-handed while you've got one hand on the gun. Once the nut is on, it's, yeah, there we go, it's see. off. Yeah, the yeah. front wheel fell off. Unbelievable. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So, oh. I keep it down, oh. I keep it down. And that's the reason why we have the, the arrow, arrow screen. screen. Ready to go back racing, and it's, uh, it's way off. Yellow, yellow. No a bit too early, there's a restart zone that's labeled on the outside. Oh, oh. huge crash in the back. Renis oh. VK, it looks like Colton Herta are involved. See we'll in the see back, now. these guys are all nose to tail. You can't really see the flagger, and he just gets into the back tire and drives right over the top of that car. And another example of the, how the safety Goodness. screen is really, I believe, just saved Renus VK's life with that. And and the fact that Colton hurt us. Oh, this is this is good on the onboard. Simon slows up. Renus, oh, it all just happens so no fast. No you have almost no time to react. Pato O'Ward is at the head of the pack. Ryan hunter Ray and Joseph Newgarden are not on the lead lap. Green flag this time. Clean start. Let's go. hunter Ray trying to get back on the lead lap. Think about this. Pato O'Ward is restarting with five Iowa wins right behind him between Ryan hunter Ray and Joseph Newgarden. Both trapped a lap, a lap down. You we'll saw when the pits open. A lot of guys came in in the back half of that top ten who were on the lead lap. They are now going to be able to make this if they want without any more stops. The guys up front will not. So they're going to have to try to get as best they can. Both of those guys are about 25 laps over on their tires. And Simon Pagano, as he slides down the inside. Oh, but Oliver really sends it around the outside, makes it makes it stick kind of at the line. Pagano is going to have the spot. He should be able to clear him here through one and two. Simon's there, clear low, clear and low. a great run off of two. He's going to get a good run on Pato Award here as well. Yeah, Could this be a last to first story for Simon Pagano at the end of the night? Simon. 74 laps to go. It's only a matter of time because he just got a big One run back. off the corner. In he dives for the inside, inside, easily goes by Pato Award, dead last to first. One Scott back. Dixon out right on his gearbox. Here. This is for the lead. Yeah, it is for the lead, but we are unsure right now if Dixon's going to have to pit. Dixon's going to make the move here and go to the lead. Here we go. Side by side, Dixon on the low side, Pagano on the high side. Pagano prevails, keeps Clear. the lead. That's a beautiful right there. From last here, to first, can you believe it? Dang. Simon Pagano wins in back, Iowa. Baby. The first night of the doubleheader weekend and the most extraordinary story. You get to do it all again tomorrow night, once again, starting from the rear. Do you have it in you? I do, I do. I never give up. So uh, if I got to do it again, I'll do it again. Uh, this was certainly, uh, it was a pretty cool win on an oval. Uh, Indy would always be the top, but this one was pretty cool too. Watch the Iowa IndyCar 250s Race 2, Saturday, July 18th at 8.30 p.m. on NBCSN.